Hey guys, welcome back to Come Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. I'm Shannon, and today on the show, we're taking a look at Transformers Generations Power of the Primes. This is TerrorCon Hunger. Alright, so, included in Hunger's packaging, you have these two. They're the feet. They go on the they become the feet when he transforms with the other Terracons into Abominus. You also get this Power of the Primes card. Terracon Hunger. Flip around. Megatronus Hunger. Eats the spark of vanquished enemies. Pretty cool. Put that back in my card holders and then mine actually came with two instruction pamphlets one's in I want to say Japanese the other is in English cool but you don't really need the directions because the Terracons are among the easiest Transformers to transform. So, what we're going to do, first off, let's go ahead and take a look at the packaging. As you can see, let's move them out of the way. As you can see, nice box. He is a Voyager class. Because he is the leader of the Terracons. There's Abominus on the side. On the back, how will Ravenous Terracon leader wield the power of the primes? There he is in robot mode. There he is in beast mode. You got Alchemist Prime, the mystical scientist, Alpha Trion, Infinite Knowledge, and Vector Prime, the time traveler. All right. And as you can see, the prime pieces, they go right in here on the feet um, or blasters whenever he's in robot mode. Um, on the other ones, they go right in here, the back of the hands. Or if you want to use them as a mace when they're in robot mode, you can do that too. It's up to you. There are no rules in place that says you can't do that. So, anyway, um, but he does come with these separated off to the side. Uh, so what I do is, now you can put them like this and have that be the end of it. Let me move this bit. Have that be the end of it, though. You know, that way he can use his blasters, have him out to the side, whatever. Or, if you want to do something with the hands of the other Terracons, you can plug them in just like that. And he, he looks a little bit, uh, a little bit better like that, I think. The only problem is, you gotta kind of do this number. That looks cool. I like it. That's usually how I have him displayed when he's not in. Abominus mode. So anyway, let's go ahead and take those off. We'll set them to the side for right now. And we're going to go ahead and transform him into beast mode. Alright, so first things first. You're going to want to flip 
his knee pads down. Just like that. Alright? Then, you're going to want to flip his paws. And lock him into place like that. Alright? So, then, you're going to open up the tail chest piece and just fold his head, collapse his head down in there. See, see what I did? Just collapses in there. And then tail comes up. Now when you have it like this, um, these get pushed out. Okay. So when you bring it up like this, you're going to want to push those like that because even though it looks like this should be the top of the tail this is actually the top of the tail it's really weird and you just bring his legs back rotate them around just like that so they'll stand they'll stand like that okay bring his other legs around All right, now you're almost there. Let's go ahead and aim the angle this down so you can see. Now you just want to take the feet, close them, <clears throat> and there you have hunger in beast mode. Pretty simple. Pretty simple stuff. So, now we're going to go ahead and transform him into the body of Abominus. So, what you want to do is, let me see, what's bring this up like that. Fold those down, and you're going to open that up. And you're going to want to kind of put it like that. Okay. Then, take the heads, and you're going to fold, close them. Fold them in. Hold on a second, guys. Let me raise this up a bit so you can see better. The thing about these Voyager classes, especially this one, is he's so long and kind of awkward. It's hard to get them all on film. All right, so you close that. Do the same thing with this side. Close his mouth. Fold them in. Okay. Then. You're going to rotate those around so that these are in the back, kind of hiding. All right. Then, what do I want to do next? Let's see here. Okay, then what you want to do is take this piece here and it opens up for Abominus's head. Okay, almost done. Because these are going to go up like that. This piece, you can see there's a groove there, and that's going to Fit right in there. Alright. Then these tabs here will tab in to these holes here. Okay. It's 
same with the other side. Just like that. Okay. And then these legs, see this tab here? It's going to tab into that hole there. Same with the other side. And uh, <laughs> we kind of forgot about the tail, didn't we? That looks a little awkward. <laughs> so we're going to fold it up just like that. Then we're going to bring down. There's his little uh, spark of combination. And there he is. Uh, you're almost there. Uh, all you got to do is take his um, things there, rotate him up, and there's the body of Abominus. Um, what I don't understand though is why two different Decepticon stickers on here. See that one has a square around it, this one's standard. I don't understand that. And these are just like this one here, only smaller. So I don't understand that. Uh, that looks a little weird to me. So anyway, there he is. Um, yeah, the uh, pegs here in between his legs looks a little awkward, but once you get them combined, uh, it's not really going to look that awkward anymore because the heads of Blot and um, Ripper Snapper will kind of cover it. So, there you have Terracon Hunger. Stay tuned next time when we're going to put them all together and form Abominus. So take care, geeks. If you enjoyed that video, make sure you hit the subscribe button right there so you can stay up to date on all things geek culture. Also, make sure you check out one of these two playlists on the side for more videos just like the one you just watched. I'm Shannon for Comic Getting TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. Take care, geeks.